This is the main batch floor for us. All of our materials sit in storage above us. Materials drop down into big scales on the other side over here. The scales are measured. They're always inside a 1% of tolerance. Once they're scaled up, they fall into uh, a holding hopper and it dumps into this. This mixer here consolidates the material and uh, turns it into concrete. Prior to that, it's just a bunch of cement and sand and rock chemicals, those kind of things. Once it enters here, it becomes concrete. We control all the materials, the loss of material. It's, it's grabbed ver uh, via huge vacuums. It's picked up, it's brought back, and it's recycled back into the mix. So there's no loss of material and there's no uh, effluent sort of floating around in the air. If we were batching concrete right now, the air quality on this deck would be the exact same. We had grown in, in a way with the city of Edmonton um, and surrounding communities that demand was sort of exceeding what we could reasonably supply and, and uh, so there was a need to create and produce a, f uh, a facility that could meet the demands of our sort of that high five month uh, building season. The idea was to try and be the biggest, best local concrete company in existence in the country and we're I think we're there. I mean, I think, you know, and it changes, but day by day, I think we achieve that. And this progressive city right now, and it really is progressive, has rewarded us for that.